so how fast can you multiply 51 with 32 I'm giving you 5 seconds so your time starts now the correct answer is 1632 okay so now let's quickly see the usual way of doing it the usual way of multiplying any two date number with any other two date number is this so 2 1 times is 2 2 5 times is 10 now 3 1 times is 3 and 3 5 times is 15 now add all the numbers in the column so it would be 2 3 6 1 this is what your answer 1 6 3 2 all right so now let me show you the faster way of multiplying any two date number with any other two date number so watch me this is what my answer is 1632 so have you understood how I have done this okay let me explain it to you in more detail all I have done here is to multiply the first digit of this number from the left of course that is the most significant digit with the first digit of this number isn't it so 5 3 times is 15 and I have written 15 here all right then I multiplied the first digit again with the other digit of this number this time okay so 5 2 times is 10 but before I put down 10 here I added to it the product of this digit and this digit that is the first digit of the second number and the second digit of the first number so 3 1 times is 3 and 10 plus 3 is 13 isn't it so I put 13 here now for the last digit all I need to do is multiply the last digits of these two numbers so 1 times 2 is 2 so I put down 2 here as simple as that 15 plus 1 is 16 and 3 2 that is what my answer is like some things are easier said than done this is one thing which is easier done than said okay because all you need to do is remember this pattern isn't it this arrow pattern and everything else will take care of itself okay that is multiply the first digit of this number with the first digit of this number and write the product here okay then multiply the first digit of this number again with the other digit of this number this time but before you put down that multiply this digit and this digit so 5 2 times is 10 and 3 1 times is 3 and 10 plus 3 is 13 and in the end just multiply the last digits of both the numbers to get the last digit of your answer 1 times 2 is 2 so I put down 2 here so the answer is 1632 now let us practice more examples and you will see with every example you practice you are able to remember this pattern of multiplication much better so there you go 8 2 times is 16 so I'll put 16 here 8 3 times is 24 and 2 1 times is 2 24 plus 2 is 26 and 1 3 times is 3 so the answer is 16 plus 2 is 1863 all right next one 2 times 2 is 4 2 times 1 is 2 and 2 times 4 is 8 so 8 plus 2 is 10 and 4 times 1 is 4 so the answer is 504 now next one 9 times 3 is 27 now 9 times 4 is 36 and 3 times 2 is 6 36 plus 6 is 42 and 2 times 4 is 8 so the answer is 27 plus 4 is 31 28 are you getting it so you see every time the same pattern is repeated all you need to do is remember this pattern so take it like that that a war is going on between this number and this number so the first digit of this number fires a missile on the first date of this number okay but this number is a very peace-loving kind so he does not say anything so 
this number again gains in confidence and this digit once again fires another missile on the other number as well but now enough is enough so this digit fires an underground or you can say underwater torpedo at this digit isn't it and then this digit also fires a missile at this digit as well so this is the pattern of multiplying the digits that is multiply the first digit of this number with the first digit of this number and write the product here so 2 times 2 is 4 okay now you multiply this digit again with the other digit of this number so 2 1 times is 2 but before you put down 2 here you have to add to it the product of this digit and this digit so 4 2 times is 8 and 8 plus 2 is 10 so carry forward 1 here write 0 here now to get the last digit all you need to do is multiply the last digits of both the numbers so, 4 1 times is 4 so your answer is 5 0 4 and once again the advantage of using this method is that that you are getting the answers from left to right the most significant digit first well you see these arrow patterns and all these markings are just for memory aid okay in the beginning as you're learning this trick but once you practice you don't need to put all that you'll just straight away put down the answer all right so let's practice that let's see how nicely you have been able to follow this pattern of multiplication so multiplying the first digit of this number with the first digit of this number 5 2 times is 10 okay now multiply the first digit again with the second digit the other digit of this number so 5 6 times is 30 but before you put down 30 you have to add to it the product of this digit and this digit so 2 3 times is 6 and 30 plus 6 is 36 now for the last digit all you need to do is multiply the last digits together so 3 6 times is 18 so write 1 here 8 here 10 plus 3 is 13 and this would be 78 this is our answer now you try to do this one okay so again multiplying the first digit of this number with the first digit of this number 7 4 times is 28 now multiplying this first digit again with the second digit of this number 7 1 times is 7 and adding to it the product of 4 and 6 7 plus 24 is how much 31 and the last digit multiply the last digit 6 1 times is 6 so 28 plus 3 is 31 16 is your answer now once again 6 3 times is 18 and 6 1 times is 6 plus 3 2 times that is 6 so 6 plus 6 is 12 and 2 1 times is 2 so I put 2 here 18 plus 1 is 19 22 is your answer